The ugly truth about dating scams, if you've spent any time dating online, you've likely encountered sketchy characters using fake photos, crafting elaborate fake personas, or even trying to con you out of money. Dating sites have become a breeding ground for all sorts of scams targeting lonely people seeking real connections. In this video, we'll expose the sleazy world of dating fraud, from basic catfishing to sophisticated romance scams designed to financially ruin victims. More importantly, we'll examine why dating platforms have become such a lucrative scamming playground and what might be done about this crisis eroding trust in online courtship. Part 1. Common Scams to Watch Out For Catfishing Scammers steal photos and create totally fake identities to deceive people sometimes just for ego boosts, but often with darker financial motives. Romance scams. Fraudsters patiently build emotional rapport and feign romantic interest with targets, only to eventually make up emergencies requiring money transfers from their partner. Sextortion. Criminals coerce people into sharing explicit content, then threaten to leak it publicly unless paid off through extortion. Account hacking. Scammers hijack real users' dating profiles, firing off dodgy links and perpetuating fraud under that stolen identity. Data harvesting, personal info like emails, locations, etc. gets harvested from dating profiles for things like identity theft rings and targeted spam campaigns. The possibilities for deception on dating platforms are virtually endless from trafficking recruitment to good old-fashioned grifting aimed at the lonely and vulnerable. Part 2. Factors Enabling Dating Scams So what makes dating sites such a target-rich environment compared to other platforms? A few key dynamics. 1. Anonymity and fake profiles. With little identity verification, it's trivial for scammers to create profiles using fake names, locations, photos, bios, etc., and dodge accountability. 2. Emotional vulnerability. Dating inherently puts emotional wants and desires for partnership front and center. Scammers cunningly exploit those human insecurities and loneliness toward deceptive ends. 3. Financial incentives. Millions of users essentially advertise themselves as romance-seeking singles, enabling fraudsters to easily fish a wide pool of potential money victims. 4. Masking identities. Loose verification allows using throwaway details like Google voice numbers to obscure real contact info from would-be targets. 5. Poor monitoring. Scam accounts often go unaddressed on dating apps unless there's egregious stuff like illegal activity or trafficking. Report systems are lacking. 6. Social stigma. Some demographics feel too embarrassed to report being defrauded while seeking romance online, enabling scammers to thrive discreetly. 7. Romanticized cultural myths. We're bombarded by unrealistic romantic ideals in the media that blind people to real-life red flags indicating scams. Essentially, a perfect storm of anonymity, money-making potential, and exploitable emotional vulnerabilities make dating sites a scammer's paradise. Part 3. Fighting Back Against Scammers So what's to be done about this epidemic eroding trust in online dating? Well. Dating companies need to step up with way more robust proactive scam prevention and user protections. More a stringent identity verification like biometric slash government IDs, advanced AI and human fraud detection slash moderation, swift process is for users to easily report suspicious activity, clear deterrence like rapid account termination and legal recourse. Too often, Dating sites go through the minimum motions and shrug at concerns over scammers operating blatantly on their platforms. Some companies seem to care more about profits than empowering users to date safely. But we as users have to take responsibility, too. Some tips. Never send money or explicit content to people you haven't met in person and verified 
use video calls to confirm matches are who they claim, stick to public meetups first before going anywhere private, do reverse image searches and background checks. If anything seems off or too good to be true, cut bait fast, basic precautions and keeping a skeptical mindset go a long way. No legitimate romantic prospect should guilt you for verifying identities or questioning sob stories asking for money. While scammers are getting more tech savvy, maintaining that security first mentality and not being afraid to seem paranoid is crucial to avoiding fraud. Red flags are better than regrets. Part 4. An uphill battle for a safe dating future. The disheartening truth is, the innately intimate and anonymous nature of online dating makes it ripe for exploitation by bad actors no matter what preventative measures get taken. There's no such thing as a perfect, scam-proof dating platform. But the current extent of endemic fraud plaguing these sites and apps simply cannot stand if they want to retain legitimacy for the well-intentioned users that keep them profitable. Companies are dragging their feet on doing their diligence while vulnerable demographics get scammed out of their life savings, dignity, and security. It will take concerted efforts by these companies to upgrade security through robust identity proofing and smarter AI for detecting coordinated fraud. In turn, regulators need to give more legal bite to pursue and prosecute serious offenses like extortion so there's meaningful accountability. Even more public education and destigmatizing conversations around this issue are needed. On an individual level, a lifelong security mindset when engaging strangers online has to become the norm. No more shaming or naivete around verifying people's claims and true identities when forming intimate connections through dating platforms. Romance inevitably requires some vulnerability, yes. But in today's scammer-infested online scene, that vulnerability must be guarded fiercely through proactive precautions and healthy skepticism by all parties involved. Trust but verify relentlessly. The moment we let our guards down completely is when the next generation of tech-savvy con artists will strike.